Josphat Njoroge is the winner of the third edition of the Mountain to Mountain Ultra Marathon in Nyeri County. Njoroge won in six hours, 34 minutes, the 80-kilometer race organized by Urban Suarez Running Club and the county government of Nyeri in partnership with the Royal Media Services and others is aimed at conserving the Mount Kenya and Abadares water towers and promoting local tourism. Martin Monene with the details. These were the scenes between Mount Kenya and the Abadea Mountains in Nyeri County on Saturday. Runners drawn from different running clubs, locally and internationally, on the road for the third edition of the Mountain to Mountain Marathon. The runners bracing the morning cold and pushing themselves to the limit in the 80-kilometer, 50-kilometer and 25-kilometer race options, all for a good course according to race organizers. Number one is uh, climate, number two is to get fit, number three is sports tourism for, for this country, for this county, and number four, we market the entire country, Kenya. Similar to what happened in South Africa, where they do from one city to one city, 90 kilometers, there's also another one called ocean to ocean, they run from one ocean to another. So they thought of bringing this idea to Nyeri, because Nyeri is unique, like I've said, it's between two mountains. And the main aim, uh, of this marathon is to conserve both water towers. Nyeri Deputy Governor David Kinaneri, who graced the event, taking part in the 25-kilometer race in a marathon in which the competition was mainly with self. Where we are going to pass, people see what is there and what they can come and see in Nyeri. And that is one way of creating that tourism uh, the runners are getting a chance to feel the power of the mountains under their feet as the marathon theme stated as they moved from one mountain to the other. It's, it's, you begin from the slopes of the Naromoro Mount Kenya and you end up here. The middle of the down is you begin from up, you come down a bit, then you rise. It's very tough. One of the toughest uh, marathons. I think the, I think the gain is about 4,000 meters above sea level. It is very tough. For the elite runners, the course offered an unprecedented challenge. Josphat Njoroge won the 80-kilometer race in 6 hours, 34 minutes. Joseph Nanga crossed the 50-kilometer mark first in 4 hours, 26 minutes, while David Kamau took the glory in the 25-kilometer race in a time of 1 hour, 40 minutes. From the beginning uh, to 50 kilometer, it was downhill and up, some uphill, so I was ready. The only challenge was the 30 kilometer from 50. That was very challenging, too much hill. But I made it. I had a temperature of na and a kidogo. But finally, Mungo has a idea to make a risk. It's my mission from January 31st. I said, I'm going to get a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of